Hello and welcome back to StarCraft Brood War. This is Mission 6, the return to Char. Um, expand and establish new bases early in the game. Having a constant supply of minerals and gas is essential to victory. Okie dokie. So. Oh shit. Yeah, thank you. I have a Zerg base. It's good to know. So. Let's sort out this Zerg base then. Uh, drone? Get there. I want you to build an extractor. DD. Awesome. Um, yeah, so, this base, as you'll notice, has no Vespine geyser, but lots of minerals. That one has a Vespine geyser, but not many minerals, and we need to expand there quite clearly. So, let us scout with our observer to try and find a place where one can get to that expansion point. Come on, my little observey. And there was a Vespian guys there as well, right? Yeah, good. Alright, so there's the ramp. There's how it's done. So we'll get the other one. Gas. Get you down here. Building a hatchery. Managing two bases at once is going to stretch my very limited competence. So, can we build the Templar Archives? No. So we need a cybernetics core first. Thank you for that. There's also this base to the west. Or I think there should be a base here. Alright, there are some Zergings on the way. I think I can deal with this though. Okay. Uh, right. I want all those to be drones. I also want to build a pile on here because I want to support this place. In fact, I'll build a pile on here because I want to support this place with cannons. Good old cannons. So these drones. Nab them. They'll go down here. This one at the very least. We'll be getting a Vespian geyser. So we'll keep droning up here. This cannon is okay so far. What was I doing? Yes, my observer. You're going to scout ahead. Because I'm sure there's a base here as well that we need to expand to. In the meantime, there are so few minerals here, it's not really worth mining on minerals, so I'll just get the three drones on gas here. Move, you naughty Ragnosaur. Alright, fine. There, that'll do the trick. Also build one up here, just to try and get some cliff support. All right, all right. So we'll keep building a few more drones here. I've uh, probes here. Three more. Do it. I know one should not queue, but where's that shooting coming from? Ah, eh. it's not a problem. So Citadel of Loon, a dune even. Let's build that citadel. Come on. <coughs> Shit, we're in danger. Yes. Alright, we're no longer in danger. Still. It's very difficult to get cliff cannon support, so that's quite useless. That can be just a pylon for supply. What am I trying to do? Right, 
Now I'd like a Templar Archives, please. Whoa, Nelly. Okay. So first of all... Right, I've got plenty of Zerglings to defend here. I'll send my guys back now. For what it's worth, we'll get a couple of cannons here along the rim of this creep. In hopes that they can get something done. <coughs> I would like... Uh, can I make hydralisks? No, I need a hydralisk den. That's fair enough. So you become a drone to replace... Alright, Hydralisk Dens are any basic buildings in StarCraft 1. Yes. They're advanced buildings in StarCraft 2 because Blizzard decided that Hydralisks are too damn good, apparently. Though, ironically, in StarCraft themselves, Hydralisks are not especially good. Well, they are, but they're very fragile. Alright. So I would like... How many DTs do I have so far? Four DTs, please. Oh, you continue to scout out this expansion I want. Because as you can see, I'm still not getting enough minerals per second. And there are some definite Zerglings. Alright, here we go. Run, my friend. We have got to get that place. <coughs> so I'll keep my observer here, over those borrowed Zerglings. So I want six Hydralisks, for starters. Where's the drone I made? Well, wherever he is. Wherever he is. Ah, shit. Ooh, that was a lurker. I'm gonna build just a couple more cannons here. And my Zerglings are gonna be running out of supply, I see. My Zerg are going to be running out of supply. So from this, we will create Overlord. Okay, fine. Hydralisks just naturally look yellow. That was a bit worrying, but they're supposed to look that way, it would seem. Come on, overlords, hatch. Good boys. So now I've got my six hydralisks ready. I'm going to have my six DTs ready and six hydralisks. We are going to try and take that. But we're also going to try... Well, I'm going to try and macro up properly and build reinforcements as I do that, because they might come at us with more juice than we currently have. Got it? Alright, what have we got here? Don't need any of that stuff. Okay. Alright, I'm going to need those things as well. Get my whole group here. And of course, I'll be ready to hopefully reinforce. Yes. Let's see what I can get done here then. Good, good. That's uh alright, we need a lair for that, so we'll just involve Caracas. Get him here. Yes. Looks like we kill them. Yes. Alright, hang on. Sorry, that was just me talking to my little sister. Yeah, I'll be with you soon, little sister. Alright, there's a lurker here. Tell. Let's try and get rid of that. Let's try and kill that quickly. Alright. Okay. I'm sure they have, but I've got a macro. Come on. Let's kill that. 
kill as many of these overlords as we can. Right, kill that quickly. Shit, there's a lurker here too. There it is. Observer. Alright, nice. Oh, fuck's sake. So I'm going to need some more cannons there, too. Alright, hang on, I'm just going to stop recording for a second, because my sister won't leave me alone. Okay, I apologise for that. So I've got my six Hydralisks, and I need three more of these dudes, that's fine. In the meantime... Build a couple more pros because I can, but we're going to try and increase the cannons around this sort of general area so that we're not, not attacked like that again. Because that could have been dangerous. Right, I heard evolution complete, so... I know that's all the things, that's good. So that's all I can upgrade here without also upgrading to a lair. Which I guess I'll do. Uh, what have we got going on here? Ground weapons three because we can. Alright, that's all I can afford there because just look at this. Oh shit. Okay, so we're in fact going to need. Let's say a couple more cannons there so that we have the juice. Bloody cannons, I tell you. Hopefully they're only interested in my Protoss base and not my Zerg base, because... Right, it's got a couple of cannons, I guess. It's got a couple of cannons and the, those Zerglings there. All will be well. Anyway. We have got to take that base while we still can. So let's go. Is this the uh, Overmind? No, that's the Carlis Crystal. That's the Overmind, which we... I've decided I'm going to... For fuck's sake, where is my Observer? There it is, that's my Lurker. Those things are horrid. Those things are absolutely horrid. I better get... Making these hydralisks then. A few more of these because. Alright, kill that, whatever it is. Thought it'd be one of those. Alright, this time focus down the hat. No, nope, that lurker. Focus that down first. Alright, get that hatchery as quickly as you can. That lurker. Alright. Come on. Take these things down. Oh god. Zerglings. There was a lurker there. Kill it. Let's see if I can take this down. What's going on here then? Uh huh. Yeah, sure. Get these over here. Okay. Oh, for God's sake. Where are my dragoons? So we need some cannons here too, evidently. Come on. Utilisks should not be this strong. Right, fuck. Okay. Let's get some Hydralisks going here as well. <sighs> I 
bet I'm doing this completely wrong. It's the only explanation. I'm probably going to need to uh, build another observer, aren't I? So, oh, I've got one here. It's fine. Alright. So that's my six hydralisks. Probably do with another couple of gateways as well. To get this Dark Templar production up a bit quicker. So come on, two more. Oh, fuck. This base has to fall. We're slowly getting there. I think. I hope. Alright, since, um... A lot of cannons went down there. We are under attack. Holy Jesus. Okay, that's fine. Let us get a bit more cannon support here as well. A bit more cannon support here. Now I've got to get those minerals while there's still something left to get. Good lord. Where's that observer? Where did I leave that observer? I'm going to bring that over here too, just in case this one dies. On that note, I'll build a robotics facility as well. Just in case I ever need one. <coughs> Alright. That should be it. Alright. Let's go in for what is hopefully the third and final assault. Done. In fact, let's start. There, that's my six backup Hydras and six backup DTs in production. Come on. Murder them all. Uh, where's my observer? that observer is. I mean, wherever that lurker is, there it is. Get back down there, observer. Lurker is ours. Thank God I put those cannons there after all. I would like to build a hatchery here, if you wouldn't mind. But then of course I'd also like cannon support across the cliffs. I've got this army to deal with whatever gets us for now. Fine. I'd also like to build some drones, of course, once I'm done with those hydras. Alright, cannons. Come on, baby. Come on! The nasty, nasty overmind. Um, where's my robotics facility? 
I need to build an observatory, do I? V. Oh. I can do that then. Alright, so drones. There we go. We're going to make sure this place is as well defended as Valhalla. Which I can only assume has some pretty stellar defense. Alright, drones. Get your little drone faces here. Alright, cool. Cannons can kill lurkers. That's brilliant. Well, that place is clearly going to need a bit more cannon defense. We'll build some drones here as well. And let's go. Re cannon the places here. Clearly, we are making a few enemies. I'm not going to even bother taking that guy's because Just look at the gas we've got. But, to something that's reasonably able to be defended, right? Zerglings, go! Cannon everything. It's all good. I'll just make more drones. We'll get this mineral thing properly saturated. Alright. I want a full group of DTs. So that's my full group of DTs. So I've got three hydras here. Three hydras. Four hydras. Two hydras. So I've got my full groups. <clears throat> and whatever's left I'll send to here, which, as far as I'm concerned, is now the staging grounds. Uh. Right, these DTs. Stage, and you are my DTs. I get some more overlords, so I can get more hydras. Of course. Oh, and you rebuild this cannon if you can, dear Charlie. Charlie the probe. I'm going to permit myself the first save of this match because I think I'm, I'm I think I'm being reasonably competent. All right. Oh, speaking of which, speaking of competence. few observers ready. And a few hydras ready. Oh, and of course I can start building hydras here as well. It's fantastic. So, what we really want, what we really, really want, is for me to find that damned observer. Where'd I put it? There it is. Scout ahead. We're gonna see if we can't take out the overworld. Hydralisk, eh? I'm pretty sure I can take you down. My warriors engaged the enemy, but it was a one-sided fight for sure. So, okay, okay, okay. And no, I don't mean anything horrible by that. Let's carry on. Mm-hmm. Alright, so here's where things start to become zergy. Okay, what have we got here? Righto. Observer. It's my third observer. I'm gonna get a group of people here. Let's launch this damned attack. I have got so much backup. Uh, I want the gates to lead 
here. If that's all the same, dear Gates. So you, my dear DTs, get over there. All right. Kill that lurker now. Yeah! Oh, I managed to get some goop on me. That's never cool. Alright, kill that thing. It's gooping us. Alright, kill that lurker quickly. Kill that guardian quickly. Yeah, good, 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 good. Kill that quickly. Right, I've only got one observer left. Alright, okay. Let's all fall back. Let's all fall back. More observers, please. Okay, okay, okay. So. Turn here. In fact, you know what? Control group three. No, sorry. Control group four. Where are my observers? Control group three. Control group three. Four. Five. We're just going to really muscle our way in there because we have got the minerals to spare. Alright. One, two, four, five. Those Zerg won't know what hit them, baby. They just won't know. They will be unaware of the things that have hit them. Are we ready, boys? Are we ready, boys? One, two, three, four, five. Come on now. Kill those damned lurkers. Kill that queen, Hydralisks. Kill it all. Alright, kill that guardian, because that guardian is going to fuck us up. Just get that overmine down. Absolutely murder it. Beautiful. Executor, the callus is ours. Let us depart this wretched world and return to Shakuras. Provided there is still a Shakuris to return to. Compared to the Battle of Braxis, I was so damn competent that time. Hopefully the interruption early on will not bugger this recording. Let us click that victory button. I think that was the lag that shows guaranteed recording. And look at that elapsed time, nearly half the time last time. I am clearly pro. The Insurgent, Executor Citadel at New Antioch, Shakurus. Congratulations, Executor. Your success has brought us the promise of hope against the Zerg. However, we face a new threat within our own ranks. In your absence, Judicator Alderis and an entire legion of Kali survivors from Ayer have begun an open revolt against us. By the gods, this is ill news indeed. Why would Elderus betray us so? He and his ilk believe that it was wrong to have abandoned Ire and consorted with our people. Their prejudices have driven them to perpetuate the Conclave's sins against us. Even now, Alderus and his loyalist Templar forces are preparing to attack our citadel. I can scarcely believe this. As if the Zerg were not enough. Matriarch, are you certain of this? All too certain, young Templar. 
the Executor, as Matriarch of the Dark Templar and Custodian of this world, I hereby order you to terminate Judicator Alderis and quell this untimely uprising without delay. There will be no dissent among us while the Zerg are poised to strike. There is something amiss here. The Matriarch has always been a wise and gentle soul. Though there is some merit in her decision, this is very unlike her. That may well be. But right now, we have a friend to kill. May Adun forgive us. And may Adun forgive us too. So, I always knew Eldaris would have to die a horrible death. Thank you for watching this. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you later.